my life always have a problems uh, like every transgender people which have in regressive society like no jobs no education no fundamental rights wherever we go people make fun of us they laugh at us because they think we are different we are different than them uh, generally uh, we get harassed and bullied because people think it's not a crime and uh, nothing will happen with them because they think there is no accountability mechanism to make them accountable i was blessed enough to be educated so i thought if not me then who because i always think that every human has the right to live the way they want because every person born they born freely and this is the basic fundamental right of every human being so i decided that my existence should be very useful for the community but the proper transgender rights movement started after gulpandra and alisha were murdered just because they were transgender persons their murders played the vital role initiating the transgender rights movement best part of the movement it wasn't centralized every transgender person who could gather in any city started campaigning for their rights and i was one of them and i did whatever i could do to take things further and with joint struggle of community transgender rights protection act was passed in 2018 and this was the biggest success of our transgender rights movement since i haven't looked back now i am running my own non-profit organization and i am working to build the capacity of my community not only my community but the relevant stakeholders including law enforcement agencies actor of justice including police lawyers prosecutors judges teachers in short every segment of society biggest challenge we face that transgender community even don't know that they were oppressed they think bullying harassment humiliation it's part of their life when bill of rights was passed we called community in a conference to brief them about what are their fundamental rights one transgender person came to me and asked what bill are you talking about electricity bill utility bill water bill or gas bill we pay our bill regularly so we have to do everything from scratch to build the capacity of our community and now with the grace of god we have transgender lawyer police officer lecturers politicians and many more who are playing their active roles in the society i have received so many international and national awards for the community services that i have done i try my best to be useful as much i can so coming generation have a little bit acceptance for transgender community i hope one day people will realize like we are human human like anyone else well This is my story and I don't want others to go through what I have been through.